Hello everyone, welcome back to Amin Maths Club. Today we have a nice Olympiad Maths problem that is a plus b is equal to a times b is equal to a over b. So we have to find the value of a and b. Here we see that we have three equations. So in, uh, in denominator here it is b. So we can say that and uh, that b is in denominator so b is not equal to 0 here b is not equal to 0 now here we can make three equations that first one is a plus b that is equal to a times b so here our second equation is a times b is equal to a over b and similarly we have a plus b is equal to that is a over b so these are three equations that we have made from this problem now here we have if we just check on the value of a from this equation we see that uh, here we have our let's say it is our first equation and it is second one and it is third one so if we just check first one with respect to a so here we have a is equal to that is a plus b is equal to a b so a is equal to here we have a times b shifting this one we get minus b now a is equal to taking b is common we have a minus 1 a minus 1 so here now it is not possible to find a and b in this equation because here we have a is equal to this one so value of a and b is not possible here now if we just check from second equation that a b is equal to a over b now here we have this if we just cross multiply here denominator is one so a b times b is a times b squared is equal to a now by shifting this a to our left hand side we have a b squared minus a is equal to zero now taking a as common we get b squared minus one is equal to zero by using algebraic rule so we have a times b plus one and similarly uh, we just write here in next step so here a is equal to 0 and this b squared minus 1 is equal to 0 now we have a is equal to 0 and from this equation we just write b squared is equal to plus 1 and taking square root on both side we see that b has two values that is plus minus 1 it means that b is equal to plus 1 and b is equal to minus 1 and we have this value of a a is equal to 0 now here we have three cases so three values actually when a is equal to 0 b is equal to 1 and b is equal to minus 1 now we have uh, three cases here now we can try the each case in original equations uh, and see for which case we can find the solution so if we just see our uh, original equations here that is first equation is a plus b is equal to a b second one is this a b is equal to a over b and a plus b is equal to a over b now we are going to just find the solution by using these three values separately so from case one that is a is equal to zero we have our first case that is a is equal to zero now if we just put in our equation one so equation one is a plus b is equal to a b so here as zero then zero plus b is equal to zero times b so here we have b is equal to zero b is equal to zero but we see that b is e equal to zero since b cannot be equal to zero so it is rejected it cannot be equal to zero as uh, it is given in our problem 
now checking this one that case 2 so our case 2 uh, here we have the same uh, value of a, a is equal to 0 so if we just put this value in our equation 2 so it is our case 1 not case 2 but we have to use our equation 2 here so our equation 2 is a times b is equal to a over b here we have 0 times b which is equal to 0 over b so we see that here we get 0 is equal to 0 so there is no solution now we can use the same value of a in our third equation so let's say uh, it is um, case 1 in third equation if we just put so our third equation is a plus b is equal to a over b but a is equal to 0 plus b and 0 over b so here we see that the value of b is again 0 which is not possible so now using this value of b is equal to 1 in these three equations original equations now here we have our second case that value of b is equal to 1 using in first equation so our first equation is that is a plus b is equal to a times b so a plus b is 1 and a times 1 here we have a plus 1 and shifting this one we get minus a is equal to 0 so plus a minus a is cancelled we get 0 is equal to minus 1 which is not possible it is not a solution now if we just use uh, the same value of b in our equation 2 so our equation 2 is a times b means b is 1 that is a over 1 so we have a is equal to a a is equal to a means a minus a is equal to 0 so 0 is equal to 0 so there is no solution now using the same value of b in our third equation so our third equation is a plus b means a plus 1 is equal to a over 1 so here we have a plus 1 is equal to a and a minus a is equal to minus 1 so a minus a is equal to 0 and 0 is equal to minus 1 so we get no solution here now we have our third case that is case 3 when b is equal to minus 1 now applying this value of b in our original equations our first equation is a plus b is equal to a b so a plus b is minus 1 that is equal to a times minus 1 here we have a minus 1 is equal to minus a so a minus a will be plus a and this minus 1 will be 1 so we get 2a is equal to 1 now if we just uh, divide 2 on both hand side we have value of a is 1 over 2 here we get the value of a from first equation so putting the same value in equation 2 so equation 2 is a times b a times b means a times minus 1 that is equal to a over minus 1 now we have minus a is equal to minus a and cancelling a on both hand side we get a is equal to a so there is no solution now here we have our third equation that is a plus b a plus value of b is minus 1 that is equal to a over minus 1 here we have a minus 1 that is equal to minus a and a shifting this one we get plus a which is equal to minus 1 will be plus 1 so we have 2a is equal to 1 and a is equal to 1 over 2 here we have value of a is 1 over 2 similarly here value of a is 1 over 2 and when we put the value of b is minus 1 now we are going to check these two values of a and b so for verification we have two values that is when a is equal to 1 over 2 and b is equal to minus 1 now we are going to check these two values in our original problem 
so our problem is a plus b is equal to a times b is equal to a over b here we have value of a is 1 over 2 so putting here 1 over 2 plus b is minus 1 is equal to 1 over 2 times minus 1 that is equal to a is 1 over 2 divided by minus 1 so here we see that 1 over 2 minus 1 is equal to minus time plus is minus 1 over 2 is equal to if we just multiply this one in denominator of 1 so 1 times 1 is 1 divided by 2 times 1 is 2 and here we put minus sign now 1 over 2 minus 1 will be 2 is least common multiple so here 1 minus 2 that we get minus 1 over 2 which is equal to minus 1 over 2 and it is equal to minus 1 over 2 so this minus 1 over 2 is equal to minus 1 over 2 which is equal to minus 1 over 2 hence we see that these two values are true values for this problem so our final answer is here we get a is equal to 1 over 2 and b is equal to minus 1 it is our final answer i hope you have enjoyed this video now we are going to check our entire solution here that our final values of a and b is a is equal to here we have a is equal to 1 over 2 and b is equal to minus 1 so it is our final answer i hope you have enjoyed this video thanks for watching have a nice day goodbye